ever do requests that I know. <laughs> um, um, I had a, a, a bloke came up to me once in Australia, and I'm still puzzling over this. He said, uh, do you do requests? And I said, yeah, what would you like? And he thought for a while, and he said, uh, you choose. <laughs> I've been asked to sing this, and especially for Luke, uh, and I, I believe this is being videoed, so hi there Luke, this is just for you, this song. It's one, uh, it's one of the earliest, I went out to Australia um, in 1960, and uh, this is one of the first songs I, I ever learnt there. Oh, is that the raffle? Um, for me, raffle. And uh, it's a song called Gentle Annie, and the Annie referred to in this song was a grandmother of, do you remember David Lumsden? John, do you remember David Lumsden? Yes. Yeah, well, well the, the Annie referred to in this song was David Lumsden's grandmother, who was a, a lady by the name of Annie Jameson, who lived up in the Riverina area, which borders New South Wales and Victoria. And at the end, uh, her parents had a, a hotel up in the Riverina area. And at the end of each of the, sir, the seasons, the shearing, harvesting or whatever, uh, the blokes would stay in the hotel and they, at the end, when they were heading off to the next place, they had adopted this little Annie girl, as she was eight years old at the time, of, uh, as a mascot, and they'd sing this song to her as a farewell as they headed off to the next uh, place. And so that's the story I knew. And Kath, David's uh, mother, just recently died. She was 99. Sad, sad news. But um, I've always, that's the way I learnt the song and knew the song from David. But apparently it is originally, Gentle Annie was a Stephen Foster song. Stephen Foster, American songwriter, wrote Way Down Upon the Swanee River and the Kept Down Races, those sort of songs. So it's, uh, but then I sang it once and an Irish bloke came up to me and he said, that song you sing, Gentle Annie, that's an Irish tune, that. And because the Irish claim every song ever written is an Irish one. Uh, but true enough, there is a, a game <coughs> for the tune called uh, I Can't Live Without You Anymore. But when you hear it, that's the tune for Gentle Annie. So Stephen Foster must have nicked it from uh, Ireland. But in uh, the late 1980s, uh, they had the Student Olympic Games were held in England, uh, up in Sheffield, round about that area. And at the end of the Olympic Games, uh, Student Olympic Games, they had uh, a concert and everyone uh, from each different country sang songs from that country. And I was very honoured to be asked to sing the songs for Australia. So. One of the songs I sang was Gentle Annie. And at the end of the concert, some Danish people came up to me. <laughs> That's a Danish song, that song. And, uh, if someone comes up to me and says that originally Gentle Annie was a Swiss sea shanty. <laughs> so here you go, Luke. Sing it with us. <laughs> now the harvest time come gentle Annie and your wild oats are all scattered round the field you'll be anxious to know gentle Annie how Very sweet, gentle Annie, and I'm sure it can be packed in New South Wales. And you'd better put a fence round those cabbage. Oh, Uh...
Oh. 